All right, all right. So, hello. Hope you're having a good day. Hope everything's going well for you. Um, so, I was looking at a weird little mod here. Say you'll haunt me. I don't know why, but I just thought it would be interesting to see what this is. Um, oh, well, I should have left that up there. Um, basically, the idea is that um, you're haunted by these ghosts that are from the Dragonborn's past. It's supposed to be like the, the, the dead family of the Dragonborn, I'll just tell you, even though I think they pretty much tell you here in the mod description. Um, let me go down to that again. I apologize. So, I mean, they don't speak, and you have to read the journal anyway, so it's not really like a spoiler you're going to know right off the bat. I had to wait about, I think about 15 to 18 hours for this first ghost to show up. I haven't seen the little child. This is like the the woman and there is a male version so if you're playing a girl character and you want a male haunting you can have that um, I'm not sure that these are really followers though when I talk to her it says I need you to do something so I'm not sure if that's really going to be a follower thing or not they are supposed to follow you wherever you go though not sure if they'll actually help you. I guess that's what I'm getting at. Let's go somewhere where we can get into some trouble and um, see if the ghost actually helps do anything. Alright, so the ghost is following. They actually say in their description to be careful about, like here it says, I need you to do something. Oh, and then you tell them to wait there or not, I suppose. Okay. So that's almost like an AFT thing. And then they won't move anymore. But she's still moving because I didn't tell her to wait there. So, okay. So let's just go out here. There is a little place we can go. Um, I don't see the child ghost yet. There's supposed to be a child ghost. But that's okay. We can just try this out and get a feel for what we're getting into. It'll be hopefully entertaining. <laughs> that's the best I can say. Hopefully entertaining. I thought there would be somebody here at the roadside ruins. Maybe it's just a uh, Spriggan. Yep, it's a spring. Let's see if our ghost helps us at all. No. Ooh, I'm almost dead. Okay. Um, oops. You know what? I didn't do myself any favors, did I? Let's see. Did I make any potions? No, I did not. Uh, okay, so the ghost does not help you. Oh, man. I am almost dead. Um... Let's try to heal myself again. Did I put this back on legendary? I must have put this back on legendary, and he's not really ready for that. Tell you what, let's do. I think I have the little cheat ring. Yeah, here we go. He'll be fine. Now. <laughs> Uh, I forgot I turned this back up to legendary, and he's not really equipped for legendary combat. So, that's okay. Alright, so the ghost follows you, but doesn't really help you. I guess you can tell them to wait. But they're not a follower in the sense that, that you can do anything else with them. And it did not kick off my AFT counter. Bandits. Oh, with loot. Dead bandits, but still. Now, I'm still running that new Cathedral Weathers and Seasons mod, so you may see some differences in my game for a little bit. 
Oh, analog of weapon in gym. It's okay. And you'll hear like actual thunder and stuff, so it's kind of cool. Um, we're trying it out. We're trying it out. So, all right. So that's the ghost. Um, I haven't seen the girl. Let's go out on the road here. And let's just be crazy and just wait for like, let's wait for like 12 hours and see if the little girl shows up. Yeah, I forgot, you get some darker nights with this mod, this weather mod, but that's okay, they're not too dark. Alright, well, I'm not seeing... Let's make a fast travel. Sometimes that will cause things to happen. Let's go... Oh, poor Crom, he, he hasn't been anywhere. And I never opened up everything for him. <laughs> oh, this is sad. Can he go anywhere? Hmm. Apparently not. Well, we can fast travel back to Falkreath. How's that? It could still cause the, the little girl ghost to spawn. Oh, there she is. There's the little girl ghost. And she gets the same option, but they say not to even bother. So there you go, so then you have these little ghosts following you everywhere you go. They're supposed to be like your wife and child, which is kind of sad, I guess. Um, it is. It makes, um, do you ever see the outlaw Josie Wells? I think uh, Eastwood's wife and children are killed while he's away. And uh, anyway, it kind of reminds me of that a little bit, except he didn't have ghosts following him. But, yep, yeah, okay, so these ghosts follow you. I don't think they count as true followers. Um, and I guess it's just to add a little story if you want to say your character is haunted um, by the ghosts of his past, so to speak. So, nothing wrong with that. It's just whatever you find entertaining, I suppose. It's a little, on the, the even the modder says it's a little on the depressing side if you really think about it like that. But, um, there you go. That's it. You get the two ghosts. What do you see? It is the mod. And I'm going to make sure I get the name right, because I don't get the name right very often. I don't remember it well enough. So, the mod is... Say you'll haunt me. And that's it. You get a couple of little ghosts following you around, and there's not a lot you can do with them. So, um, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.